Hey there everybody, welcome back to Deer Meat for Dinner. I'm Rob, Sarah's behind the camera. This is Tasty Tuesday number 25. And today really is Tuesday, but you're not gonna see this until tomorrow because today I've been under the boat and one of our very good friends had a, had a friend pass away. And while we were in the Bahamas, we caught some wahoo. So we wanted to make dinner and take over to our very dear friend, Lindsay DeFabrique, Nick's wife. So the first thing I'm gonna do, Real quick, we've got some fresh rosemary. We just want to dice this, dice this up. Not so fine, you know, you just want to dice it up. When you dice the, the herbs, you release a lot of the oils and allow it to penetrate into the, into the fish. This fish would be amazing, just like this. You could, you could do tilapia, you could do catfish, bass, um, walleye, there's any, any fish. This is real thick, so I'm just gonna butterfly it and make it nice and thin. Look how pretty that fish is. Okay, very first thing we're gonna do, original Everglades, you know I love this stuff. We're not seizing it very heavy, we're just gonna sprinkle it on there just like that a little bit right on the meat. Next, I'm gonna do some mayo. And you can tell I'm rushing because Nick is a dentist and he's been at work, he's super hungry, and we don't wanna show up there late. I know this is probably gonna look crazy to you guys, like what is he doing? But just stick with me and I promise, please, 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 please try this. Put the mayonnaise on your fish. And we're not going to overpower the fish. This will not overpower the fish. This is, when I tried it, a friend of mine told me about this recipe. I was like, you're slap crazy that I, I tried it out, added a few things to it. And I'm here to tell you, it came out amazing. Take your fish, lather it up, get your hands dirty. My hands are clean. I just took a shower although they are stained from a long day's work. I've got two full pans, we're ready to go. Here's something that just adds so much life to this. That's a navel orange, this is a zester. When you zest, you get all the oils from the fish. You can do this with lime, you can do this with any citrus. From the fruit. Yeah, from the fruit. Whatever I said, you know what I mean. Now, got orange zest. Now we're gonna take and just put some breadcrumbs on it. Just follow along here, you guys. Follow along. I promise this isn't the most exciting video I've ever made, but if you try this dish, if you just follow step by step any white fish, you could even do this with salmon, you are going to be very happy. Now, here's some fresh, uh, this is Romano cheese. You could use uh, Parmesan cheese, Romano cheese, whatever you'd like. Sprinkle, you're not going heavy on the cheese. You're not going heavy on the cheese. Put some orange juice right over top of it. You don't have to go overboard with the oranges. Just get some, get some orange juice on top. Nice fresh orange juice. And then to end this all off, we're taking fresh rosemary. And now that's prepped. All I'm going to do is put some okay, done. Now, here's a fact. We are not expecting a child right now. I know a lot of you guys think we were, but this is our refrigerator. 
This is our notepad. I always leave her messages, she always leaves me messages. My world, I am so incredibly in love with you. I cannot wait to start our next chapter in life together. You mean everything to me. That's her note to me, so sweet. But the fact is, we're, we're trying to get pregnant. We're working on one. You know, like I just worked this up, but we're working up something <laughs> elsewhere. And um, when it all comes together, y'all will be the first to know. Now, we're going over to Nick and Lindsay's. <laughs> We're gonna cook this up, we're gonna make a salad. I've already bought rice, so nothing special there. Hope you guys enjoy it. Thanks so much for being a part of our lives. This is Deer Meat for dinner. We're out. So, they have a very beautiful house. They, these are really, really awesome people right here. There's a puppy gonna attack! Hey! Seriously, staring at you, and she's like, "Oh." <laughs> for dinner, uh, home catering hey. service. <laughs> Come on in, sorry. Hi, girl. Hi, how are you? Good to see you. Hi, girl. Hey. How are you? How are you? I'm doing good. This is Lindsay. I want y'all to see. This is Lindsay. She looks like Sarah's sister, huh? Can you can you turn on 350? This gonna have on the oven 350. All right. What's up, brother? Hey, man, How was your uh, Bahama trip the other day? Good deal. That's Alex. This, That's Alex. Alicia. This is Alicia. Hi. I have no idea how they had such a good day. <laughs> I mean, it was just this beautiful family. Thank you. <laughs> Hola. Hey. <laughs> okay, we're gonna let it up now. Yeah, so what she's saying though is it's preheated to the fifth. And she's gonna put both of those in there. Oh, should I take the little foot off? No, leave it on. Okay, for how long? Do it for 15 minutes. All right, so Sarah just put the fish in the oven. We're gonna do 15 minutes, 350 degrees. Now we're gonna make salads. This is just a little Phil Green Melody. Medley, Melody, Medley, whatever you want to call it. Then we got some organic sun-dried wow. cranberries. Then we've got sliced almonds. Get a little bit of fresh fruit. He didn't wash his hands, I promise. Yeah. <laughs> no, I washed all my hands. All right, you guys, so they've been in there at 350 for uh, 15 minutes. So now all we're gonna do, take that off. Okay, now we're just gonna turn on the broiler. Broil. Okay, so now, this is a trick I'm telling you guys. When you're doing this, don't get all crazy and let the broiler burn it because those breadcrumbs on top will burn really, really easy. You wanna keep an eye, that's why I got lights on. Smell that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Looks like I burned my nose on it. <laughs> I thought it was gonna like go yeah, I, mean, your I, I didn't want to burn my nose again. <laughs> Alright you guys, it is time to put finishing touches on this Tasty Tuesday meal. Look at that. Now, until we come out with smell of vision, y'all are just gonna have to watch. <laughs> All we've gotta do to finish this plate out, we'll go just like this. Grace is like, oh you talking to me? Yeah. Just comes right out. Um, now what we've got, we've got that salad with some sliced almonds, organic sun-dried cranberries, fresh melon, a little rice pilaf, some fish. We're gonna finish it with, this is the Panera bread tangerine honey sauce. Like that. There you go. Now, come here, Lynn. Come here. <laughs> I wanted to know this being serious. We wanted to come over and cook you dinner tonight because we're, you know, we're sorry about your friend Aww. who passed away. Mm -hmm. and Thank you. So, you know, friends are always there for friends. You guys sometimes go out of your way to do something special for someone else. Thank you. This looks delicious. We appreciate it. There you go. 
Hey, do you guys, you, you've been on a, on a ship before, correct? Yes. Yeah? That's Any right. big ones? Cruise ships? Yes. yes. What's the biggest ship in the whole world? Or what's the greatest Royal ship? Royal Caribbean? I know the answer. Wrong. I know it. What is it? Friendship! <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Seriously, guys, thank, thank you. 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 Thank that's awesome. That's fantastic. Yeah. yeah. This is very good. That yeah. orange just it adds yeah. a lot. Yeah, it does. Uh -huh. it's really good. To, in, in my honest opinion, the orange zest that's, is the that's it's the, 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 the my mouth is watering so that I can't really talk. Oh, but try it. the essence of it, it's like that oil you can smell it before you taste mm -hmm. it, you know? Mm -hmm. What do you think, honey? Two thumbs up. Delicious. Good As time. always. Really good stuff. This is delicious. So I think this is better than the other night, though. Oh, yeah? It's yeah. pretty good. Mm -hmm. Fantastic. What do you think? So, the scoop is, you guys, I had a crazy day at work today. I was under the boat, pulling rudders out, changing or pulling off props, and um, long day at work. We came back. We wanted to come visit with Nick and and Lindsay and, and their awesome family. Unfortunately, we weren't able to meet Jack. Um, Jack, uh -huh. sooner than later, we're gonna get to meet you, hopefully. Um, whatever. Um, so it's a great time. And go out of your way to enjoy your friends, family, walk over, say hello to a neighbor. And I'll tell you, you wanna know a cool thing to do? Cook up a big meal and walk over to a neighbor's house that you've never met before, knock on the door, and say, hey, I'm Robert Arrington, or whatever your name is. We just cooked this, and I'd like to ha give you some. Try that one time. Just try that. You may be embarrassed, but try it, and then walk away. And the next thing you know, the plate will be cleaned at your door, and you'll have a friend. There'll be a really cool bond there. So thanks a lot for hanging out with us, being a part of our channel, our YouTube family. And we are... Out. Out.